This tutorial will demonstrate how to use apps and extensions on your Chromebook and how to distinguish the difference between both. Chrome apps are links to useful tools and sites that will help you do everything from play games to shop to manage your productivity online. Your apps can be accessed through your shelf, which is on the bottom left hand side of your Chromebook screen, or through the launch pad, which will open when you click on the rectangular shaped icon. As you download apps, they'll accumulate in this launch pad area. You can find and add apps by accessing the Chrome Web Store. The store is divided into several categories. You can browse through your areas of interest, you can browse by popular items, and you can browse by category of education or people who you follow on Google+. Browsing in the web store can be overwhelming, so if you click on a category, it narrows it down by topics, such as in education, you can look through academic resources, family apps, foreign languages, or teacher and admin tools. After browsing through the multitude of educational apps, once you find an app you like, it's easy to find out more information to decide if it's for you. If you click on the app, you'll find an overview, as well as details, reviews, and related apps that just might interest you. Once you decide that a particular app is one that you want to add to your collection, just click and add and it'll go into your collection. You can even suggest this app to people in your Google circles or through email. Once your app has been added, you can access it easily right from the web store. Most apps simply serve as shortcuts to get to very useful or powerful tools. It's nice to have right there in either your shelf or in your launch pad. Just click and go and it opens right to the page. Extensions are also valuable, very useful tools, but they're different than apps. Whereas an app takes you directly to a specific page or specific tool, extensions are little programs that add new features to your browser and personalize your browsing experience no matter what page you're on. Finding extensions is a lot like finding apps. You access them through the Chrome Web Store, and down near the bottom you'll see a link to extensions. Similar to apps, there are hundreds of extensions you can add to your browsing experience, so you can browse them by category, or spend time perusing the list until you find something that interests you. Once you see something that might be handy, you add it, just like you did with an app. This time, though, instead of going into your launch pad, You'll notice an icon appear to the right of your address bar on the far right side of your browser. Adding the extension of Google Hangouts will allow me to easily, with a click, launch a Google Hangout with a colleague or a friend. Chances are, if there's a tool you want, there's a tool you'll get. If, like many of us, you're addicted to Pinterest, there's an easy shortcut you can add to your browser, an extension, that'll allow you to quickly pin anything from nearly any web page. In this example, by searching Pinterest, you can see that I receive many extensions. I'm looking for the one that's generated right by Pinterest. It's free, so I add it to my browser, and up pops the icon that'll allow me to pin. By adding this particular extension, if I'm visiting a site that I find particularly useful, I can click the Pin It button, and it'll add it into my collection of pins in Pinterest right from this website. You'll notice now that no matter what kind of page I'm in, whether I'm in my browser, whether I'm in my email, or some other site, my new extensions will always appear in my browser window for quick and easy use. To see all of your extensions or to manage them, go to your Settings toolbar and click on Settings. On the far left side, you'll see the extension link that will allow you to view all of the extensions you have enabled. If you want to remove an extension, simply click on the garbage can or uncheck the Enabled box to disable the extension. For more information and ideas on how to use your Chromebook or to access our printable guides, please visit the bpstis.org website where you'll find lots more resources just like these produced by your Billings Public Schools Technology Integration Specialists.